What's up everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Vidiga Vibes here and welcome to another video. Hope you are doing well. I know it's been quite a while even though it's just been a week. But um, yeah, I've got a new setup. I'm back in my old room again and I got rid of my bed. It's actually in another, in another room. So this is my studio where I will be editing, I will be sewing, I'll be have like my old rack and stuff there. So you guys will see that in another video or so. But um, yeah, the reason why I've been away for a bit is I started uni two weeks ago and I got a new job two weeks ago as well. You're gonna fucking laugh, <laughs> I know. <laughs> but I started doing Uber Eats delivery and dude, I am so happy with it because it's so flexible with my university schedule because I started uni two weeks ago it's a heavy workload and to be able to be flexible and work when I want, wear what I want and also make as much money as I want, it's a win-win dude. So I started that new job two weeks ago. It's been so, so great and yeah. So that's just a few updates, but we're gonna get into today's video. And yes, you got clickbaited, but it is true. I did buy a pair of Yeezys and yeah, you're probably judging me like vibes. Why the fuck you buying Yeezys fam? And for good reason, these shits are so hard and I know what you're looking at, it's not a Yeezy box and because it's not actually like a Yeezy boost silhouette. These are in fact the um, Yeezy Power Phase in the triple black. There we go, nice and straight. These are the Yeezy Power Phase in triple black and these are freaking nice dude, I'm not gonna lie. I When I first saw these, I was like, hey, it's kind of like a rip off, like the Reebok Workout Plus model, I believe. But Nevertheless, the sole is a little bit different and the actual quality on this shit is fucking superb. But um, I will get out both shoes. My girlfriend actually got the gray pair, which was the second release of this shoe. And unfortunately, they were too big for her. But when I saw that particular pair, I fell in love because I like this silhouette. I like how it's like semi-bulky, but it's still a low-cut shoe. I like the quality. The leather is very, very plush. So it's going to age well, it's going to crease well, and it's going to wear in really really well. But here they are, the Yeezy Power Phase, or marked as Adidas because it has Adidas branding on the back and stuff like that. But it's a very, very simplistic and very versatile shoe in someone's wardrobe like mine, where I need a nice casual shoe for uni. I need to be able to just throw on a particular shoe, just wear like a pair of track pants or just crop trousers and that's it. Can't tell you the last time I bought a pair of shoes and I don't have much to go by. Like Ramones, yeah, are nice and like versatile, but they can be uncomfortable. And when I have like a four, six hour day at uni, I'd rather just go with these. I've been wearing my bands lately, but to step it up and get a pair of Power Phase, very, very nice. We've got some Calabasas branding, which is actually stamped. It's not embossed or anything. And we've got the Adidas branding which is in like a nice Gucci colorway fam. Some fucking green and red and nothing on the other side. It's just plain black right there. Some Adidas branding at the back and we've got some mesh inlining as well on the inside right there, which I don't know if you can fucking tell. But there's not much else to say about this dude. The outsole is pretty nice and clean. It's just very, very simple with Adidas branding as well right there. Material on this is all leather and it's super plush, man. Like it's so soft. Like. When I saw the grey pair, which my girlfriend copped, but then ended up selling because they were too big, and they're not even grey, they're fucking blue, they were so plush, and I was really surprised by how like good quality they were for the price that you pay, like 200 bucks, even though these Australian retail were 200 and end clothing had them for 140 I don't get that. I mean, like, I do with, like, imports and shit. But the colorway on this, it's not an all-black... I mean, it is an all-black shoe, but it's not jet black. Like, if you compare the actual color between a black pair of Vans and the actual um, Power Phase, this looks a lot more aged. And that's great because this will age with time. It'll get, like, it's nice distressing type look if you do end up beating it. But the actual black is not a jet black. It's more of an aged black. And that is awesome. I'll throw up the on feet now as I go over sizing and let me tell you, sizing is all over the joint because the previous model or the previous colorway, sorry, actually had to go down half a size. And this one, you should go true to size, if not half a size up if you have a bit of a wide foot. I went to a true to size 10 and they fit fine, um, but it's like a UK nine and a half and a US 10. So they kind of just went back to like true sizing. So just be mindful when you do copper pair because I've seen a lot of people try and trade these to get their true size. But um, yeah, 200 bucks, easy model to pair up with. You can wear an easy pair of like, just simple track pants, baggy track pants, even crop pair of trousers, and let that not do the talking. Let it be very, very subtle, and let your top half or your outerwear or your tee or whatever do the talking. 
But nevertheless, I'm super happy. I got a pair. I just went to Chadston. I could have gone, like, I went like a couple hours earlier. I could have just gone on fucking time and got them. But if you do want to get a pair, don't pay resale. If you are, pay like 10, 20 bucks. That's all you need. But they're a mad GR. Like, they're all over the market. And like, if you want to go on StockX, make sure you sign up because you can get $20 off international shipping or free shipping if, you win, if you're within the United States, I'm pretty sure. But with all that being said, if you want to know how I'm going to style these, subscribe and join the game because here on Vadugo Vibes, I upload at least one video every single week regarding menswear, styling, pickups, reviews, all that type shit. So if you want to go ahead and join, hit that subscribe button. If you want to go ahead and check out my recently uploaded video, it's just over there. And I will see you on the next video on Vadugo Vibes. I'm out, guys. Peace.